Station platform at the Times Square Station. I want to for Lauren Glass is in Times Square live with the breaking details. Lauren. Liz and David, take a look behind me and you will see officers, MTA workers, and police tape blocking the entrance for the one, two, three trains downtown here at Times Square. At about 1.20, police say a woman was pushed onto the tracks right as the downtown one pulled into the station at Times Square. That now, mind you, I was going to tell people, well, give people advice on being safe, but if I say some shit and people see this video, they could sue my ass. So I'm going to shut the fuck up and roll a clip. This is the local train and the woman who was pushed has died. Her body still under the subway car, according to police, while their investigation continues. Police say they have a female in custody who they are calling a person of interest. She was apprehended by transit police who were flagged down by witnesses on the platform. It is unclear whether the person of interest and the victim knew each other. Now, this is what I want to say to MTA, right? Not bashing MTA or anything of the sort because everybody got to eat and do their thing, whatever, right? Public transportation. Now, in order for you to go into New York City, you got to pay a congestion fee. And they have these, these cameras set up on certain blocks. When you travel those blocks, they take a picture of your car. They charge, I think they charge private cars $20 a day based upon how much time they pass on that area. And then they charge... Um, taxi drivers, myself, um, I think they charged me two times or something like that, but I don't fuck with my hand like that because I don't feel like I should be paid to be driving people in an area. Fuck out of here. Now, people that's coming in from Jersey, I don't know what's the payment plan for them, whatever, but y'all trying to reduce the amount of traffic that comes in the city and y'all sending people to their death. Make it make sense. At this point, we're looking into that. We have the, our person of interest in Midtown South squad. Uh, we're going to be questioning her, and um, we're working with the Manhattan District Attorney's Office on this, and we're looking to go forward uh, as well, prosecutor. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, there's no service over here on the one, two, and three. Now, no service on the train. That means your shit is fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you have somewhere planned to go, somebody died, the whole fucking day is fucked up. You don't lost time, money, and you probably got a route different. Meanwhile, train service on the downtown tracks has been bypassing 42nd Street, and that's forcing commuters to reroute as they enter the rush hour. I'm disabled, and it's going to take for me more to walk and figure out what to do. So that's a big problem that MTA has, accessibility at all of its stops. So it's definitely more complicated, not to mention time consuming. Very frustrating. Trying to get home. Right. So people days basically derailed because some asshole decided to kill some other lady because of her fucked up life or whatever. It's never right to take somebody's life. But MTA is charging all this money, right, for you to ride the train. And they can't even protect the riders. Make that make sense. Kids. So it's very frustrating. Now, police say they are looking at video from the platform and from the subway entrances to see what the connection is between the two women, the woman who is in custody, who is considered a person of interest, and the victim who died as that train plowed right into her. And you can see behind me, still no way going downtown here at 42nd Street. Trains are rerouting. That's on the local and the express lines. You can still get downtown. You just can't get there from 42nd Street. They hope to return service as soon as possible so MTA before more people start losing their lives get your shit together because people is getting quite keep, people are keep on getting killed frequent on your watch well not saying you're watching but on your platform they be getting killed on your platform too fucking often so whatever y'all gotta do get on it Put some more beat cops in there. Put some undercover agents there. So these people don't lose their life. Because these people have family to go home to. Now this lady making plans to hang out with her family. She's fucking dead. Who's to blame? The person that pushed them. But at the end of the day. MTA got to take some form of accountability. Because yo. You guys want us to ride the train. But the trains is not safe. Alright man. Like, share, subscribe. Man's Space Show.